Hey guys, okay, welcome back to part four. Oh my gosh, this is the last part, I promise. And we'll talk about Jay again. Um, so anyway, um, yeah, so I came down here and I was really battling everything. And I'm just like, I don't want to do it. But I'm like, I already ordered the food. And I said that upstairs too, I, b- before I got high and stuff. I said it upstairs and I was just like... I already ordered the food. I already ordered everything. Like, I, I just got to eat it. And I was like, oh, it's whatever. I just got to eat it. But I came down and I smoked and it just made me clear. And it was just like, don't eat it. Because honestly, and I'm like, I was thinking to myself, I'm like, the food is going to go to waste. And I'm like, honestly, it goes to waste anyway because I just eat it to pick it up. It just doesn't do anything. Like, it's going to come out right away anyway. And I said, and then I started, I'm like, no, that still sucks because you're still getting some nutrients or you're still having that feeling or whatever. You can't give someone a vomit up burger, like, or whatever. So I'm like, well, you know what? Everything else, everything that I ordered can go in the freezer except the three burgers that I ordered. So I ended up saying, let me just call John and tell him not to order anything and just eat the three burgers that I got and um, maybe some chicken nuggets or whatever. But the chicken nuggets can go in the freezer, and I can give them to, um, to Jay's. Um, the pizza can go in the freezer, and I can give it to Jay's. The pasta, I can go in the freezer, and I can give it to Jay's. Like, all of these things I can give to Jay's, and I can put it in the freezer. Like, he will be set for a while, you know? So, I was just like, I don't need to, I don't need to, um, you know, do this. Like, I don't need to, I don't need to cheat. Oh, sorry. I had to itch. Sorry. Um, but I'm like, I don't need to cheat. So I ended up calling John and I said, Hey, listen, don't hate me, but I don't want to eat the food and I'm not going to eat the food. Um, and I said to him, I said, maybe I'll change my mind in the middle of the night when I come upstairs and I smell all that good food. Or maybe I won't change my mind and have some willpower. But I told him, I was like, I said exactly what I was saying. Like, I've always wanted to do this and I always don't. It's only 40 days. It's perfectly fine for me to not eat for 40 days. It is perfectly okay. Uh, The pizzeria that I love is going to still be there. McDonald's is going to still be there. Um, What else? Uh, What else? Wendy's is still going to be there. You know, um, I can always get pasta. I can always get ground beef and better ground beef. I can always get broccoli, you know, good broccoli. So it's, you know, even better. Like, I can make it so great. Like, I can make it so grand. And then I can get the stuff that I didn't get. Like, what was going to be my sweet for tonight? I was looking for something sweet, and I just didn't really get anything. So I was like, no, this is not worth it. Even though I ordered everything and I ordered the food, it's not worth it. So anyway... The reason why I want to say this to you is, one, I'm so proud that I did not cheat, and I'm so proud that I'm going to be going on day three and have a full day of day two. Um, Two, I just want to let you know that I am... I am human, and I can slip up, but even if I did eat that pizza, even if I did binge today... Tomorrow is another day, and you can always get back on the saddle and get back on the horse, but you should always try to use your willpower, and this um, also that anybody can do it. It is hard. Food is an addiction, so anybody can do it, and anybody can um, overcome it, you know? So... It's really, it's really um, up to you, and it's really how you want to look at it. I am tired of being this way. I am tired of not feeling beautiful and sexy and able to wear a bikini on the beach and feel comfortable. I am tired of not being the person that I want to be, the skinny, sexy person that guys want to turn their heads at. I'm not saying that guys don't turn their heads at me now, but I don't feel 
like they should. Like, when people are like, oh, you're so beautiful. Like, really? Like, I feel like I'm a fat whale. And I don't want to feel like that anymore. I don't want to feel like that anymore. So, you know, and that is something that I want to be sexy and beautiful. And, you know, I want people like Jay, who I'm bringing him up because that's the next topic, um, just ghosted me or whatever. And all I can think about is, is because I'm not pretty enough, I'm not skinny enough, I'm not sexy enough or whatever. He was tired of me, you know, my roles and my, my flab and all of that. Like, that's how I feel. Like, that's why he probably de- uh, defriended me and is not talking to me because he found someone skinnier and prettier than me. You know, like, all of those things are what I'm thinking about all the time. And I'm tired of that. And I don't want to do that anymore. I want to feel beautiful and sexy and whatever. And again, I'm not body shaming anyone. I'm not fat shaming, not skinny shaming, not, not body shaming at all. I'm just saying that. I'm not happy in my body. I'm not happy in my skin how I am now. Um, some people say I'm, I'm very beautiful and that I'm not fat, you know, and things like that. But you can say it all you want, but if I don't feel it, I don't feel it. And so for people who are like me and they don't feel pretty they don't feel sexy or whatever and they want to do it listen don't wait for tomorrow start today you know um like honestly it's just you just gotta get up and do it and you gotta get a little uncomfortable to get what you want so that's why I said this to you guys and that's why I wanted to do this because whenever I am you know, sad or feeling like to quit again, I can probably look at this video and say like, look, I even, I went so close to ordering food and everything and I still didn't do it because I don't want to be this way anymore. So, um, to future Vanessa, if you're watching and, um, uh, to, uh, anybody who else is getting this message, uh, definitely, achieve your goals (laughs) but anyway that's pretty much it for the update so I'm not gonna eat I'm gonna weigh myself when I come upstairs I'm gonna drink some water and I'm gonna go in my bed and watch 600 pound life (laughs)